What's happening, guys? It's your boy. I'm back, and you're back with me in the brocade. So guess what? You already know what it is. We got that Jiu-Jitsu guys in reaction. And based on my reaction last week, you know I'm down. And I'm excited for this week's episode or the episode right now, if you will. But before I get started, a couple of things, guys. I keep telling you guys, I got that podcast going on. Blurred Lines, guys. Check me and my friends out as we talk about everything in nerd culture from a different perspective. All right? I, I hope you watched the first episode because that was dope as hell. I had a great time. We're going to do episode two tomorrow, and I'll definitely let you know when that new episode app, when that new episode is going to drop, all right? And you already know the deal, guys. Like, comment, subscribe. Click on the bell notifications. Definitely comment down below. What did you think about the episode? And what did you think about the video? Let me know. All right, so I'm tired of talking. Let's get to it. Yo, literally, like, no lie, this really reminds me of <laughs> Naruto, uh, the Chunin exams. You know what I mean? Like, how they had to work as a team to try to get to the goal. It reminds me of the same, it's basically the same thing. Let's see how they do it, though, with this time around, you know? Ooh. Oh! Oh! <laughs> My boy Toto, let's get it, bro! He said, yo, I want all the smoke. Come back. Up, uh, up. Uh. My boy, you uh. Yes. We about to see my boy, Yuji versus Toto, bro. Let's get it, bro. Woo. Damn. Got the two monsters getting at it. That's what I'm talking about. If you see my boy in the Dory's face, he ready, bro. He ready. He said, give me them hands, bro. Yeah, I was about to say, it, it, it looked like they were ready for Toto to come. My boy said, I'm going to win this fight, bro. Yes. Oh, Ooh Damn. Yo. Yo. Toto lost the shit out of Yuji, bro. <laughs> Damn, I wanna oh shit. Yo, we stomping this dude, bro. This nigga about to break the tree. Oh, Oh no! <laughs> Yo! Yo, he just killed in a dory, bro. What the fuck? Yo! Yo, half his, his head is bleeding and shit. God damn. You think you just powdered my head like that, bro? <laughs> you think you gonna get away with that now? <laughs> Honey, you know she's an idol. <laughs> Toto asking the right questions, bro. Yo, 
するなただの死なさだめだ What's your type, bro? What's your type? Tall woman with a big ass, bro. Tall woman with a big ass like Jennifer Lawrence. <laughs> They total fell in love, bro. <laughs> bro. <laughs> Yo, this dude really right here. Daydreaming about these two hanging out talking about bitches. <laughs> the females, I'm sorry. Oh my gosh. I cannot believe what's going on here. Bro. What the fuck is going on here? Like, seriously. <laughs> like, what the hell is going on? This dude is daydreaming? What the fuck? Yo. Yo. The fuck is going on? <laughs> Yo, you see it, the face is so blank. <laughs> Yo, what is going on here, bro? Oh! Oh! You got the girl coming with the shoddy! Oh! Oh! <laughs> Yo. My boy is dodging everybody, bro. Yo. Yeah, dude, they're trying to kill you. I told you I'm killing you if you didn't hurt, didn't I? <laughs> he said, no, you kill us if we ordered you around. His best friend. Yeah. <laughs> I don't even know how Itadori's gonna even beat this dude, man. I mean, he still has his power that he didn't get to use yet, but still. Yo, Toto is a whole powerhouse out here. Jeez. Ooh. My boy Megumi on the hunt, bro. Yo, this is getting real good, bro. Okay, okay. Uh, uh. Yes, yes, yes. The girl with the spear is fighting the girl with the sword, and Megumi fighting that dude with the longbow. Yes, let's get it. All right. What? <laughs> Well, yeah, that's right. That's when, uh, I guess this is the point when they figured out that, um, the Kyoto group was going after Yuji to kill him. Right, Megumi just said that, right? It's still kind of weird that the beer, uh, the beer, the panda is talking like a normal person. It's weird, but it's kind of cool at the same time. <laughs> I ain't even gonna fight. Damn, I got a handshake. Sheesh. That's that attack was strong. 
It's a little like to me. <laughs> that is so freaking weird. <laughs> uh. Wait, does does Fushi? Oh, that's 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 the tone tone. I, fuck, what is it called? I think it's called the Tontas or something like that. Or so, something like that. Yes! And the door we give in the hands. Yes! Here we go, yes! It looks like they're matched pretty much as well, not matched, but it seemed like Inadori and Toto, they 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 both got strength. But Toto has more strength than Yuji, I think. But Toto, I mean, but oh got him with the cursed hand! But uh but Inadori is more uh He's vers more versatile. And he has strength too. Damn. His more strength is... Oh, so Toto, so uh, Itadori is stronger than Toto. Yo. This dude, yo, Toto look like he about to bust the biggest nut right now. <laughs> yo. Okay, so the blue haired girl, which I already knew from Jump Street, she's not trying to kill you, you know, uh, Itadori. She ain't trying to even do all that. She just want to get more advanced in rank, you know, so she can get promoted and all that stuff. Ain't nothing wrong with that. And she's trying to get next to Gojo, you know, cause that's her, that's a booger bear, that's a boo. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> At least she real about it. She's like, yo, I got to advance because I'm poor and I got two brothers to support. That, that ain't real. I don't know what is. <laughs> yo, this dude Toto was crazy, but he one of my favorite characters in Jujutsu Kaisen, honestly. <laughs> oh! Uh. That music, bro. You know somebody go there. Oh. Oh. Somebody go down next episode, though. <laughs> All right, so I just finished Jujutsu Kaisen episode 15. That shit was dope. <laughs> Yo, um, man. The fight between Toto and Itadori... That shit was so dope and funny at the same time, bro. Um, Toto is one of my favorite characters in Jujutsu Kaisen. Just for the fact that he is so real, bro. He he is an actual... Like, that is so relatable, man. Like, he he, he, he mad cool people, you know? Um, I do find it interesting that... Itadori is able to fight Toto because he is such a freaking monster, dude. Like, mind you, he has so much raw strength and power that he doesn't even need to use his act physical, like his actual cursed techniques or, or yeah, his cursed powers to, he don't even need to really use them. That's the crazy part. And I think we saw a little bit of what he can do. Because if you notice, when they were fighting and everybody came to jump him, uh, you saw that Itadori and the bow guy, they switched places, right? So I know that I know that wasn't one of the other students, like Megumi and them, because I don't think nobody in that uh, group can do that. So I think that was Toto himself. And the bow guy actually looked surprised, like, he wasn't sure who, who did it. So I don't think they know. I don't think any of them on that team, except for the girl with the uh, with the shoddy, except for her with the Magnum, I don't think 
nobody on that team knows what his actual power is or what he can do. Which is funny because, you know, they all, I, I don't know how long they've been training and been together. I don't know. But it's crazy that they don't know what this dude can do. But again, he has so much raw power that he really don't need to use his power like that unless he really wants to. Like I said, the... <laughs> Oh my gosh, um, the fights were very cool. Um, I definitely want to see Miwa against, uh, what's this girl's name? Uh, uh, Miwa against the girl with the glasses with the spear. That's going to be a dope ass fight. And then I got to see my boy Megumi, Fush or Fushiguro, whatever you want to call him. I got to see him get into some action too. He did a little work here and there, so that's dope. Um, the animation, of course, was on point. It's always on point. It was crazy. Um, you know what, though? I like how they do their fights, too. Because, like, I like how Itadori was moving. Like, he was moving very fluid, giving them boxing hits real quick. And then, you know, or maybe, I'm going to say UFC. That's cool. Because he was doing combinations like punch, 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 kick, kick. Come out with the roundhouse kick. Come up above with the divergent fist. You know? It was all great. It was good. Oh, man. I can't wait for the next episode, all right? Uh, let me see what else. Let me see what else. Let me see what else. Oh, uh, I thought it was interesting what um, the panda was saying because panda was saying was that, um, you know, it, it's crazy that the old man or the, t the people up top is trying to kill with a dory. And the bear, the bear, the um, oh my gosh, not the bear. Um, the panda was saying to, uh, I forgot the girl's name, the Buki, I think, the one with the, the one with the brown hair. I, I'm gonna learn their names. I'm sorry, guys. I'm gonna learn their names. I promise. Um, he was say, panda was saying to her that, well, we gotta look, look at it from this way. They haven't spent time with Itador. You know, we know he's a good guy, but they don't know that. All they see is Sukuna. I'm sorry. All they see is that he's a vessel for Sukuna. And that alone spreads fear to them. So that's why they're trying to get do all they can just to kill this kid. You know? And I thought that was very interesting that he brought that up. So I don't know if there's going to be a point where they're going to stop trying to assassinate him. I don't think they will. I think we're going to get like one big fight from Itadori, from one of these assassins too, not just from here. So we got to see about that. Um, other than that, this was a great episode. Loved it. It was it was funny as hell. Toto just having a whole, uh, not a flashback, but like a daydream of them being best friends and shit. Like he didn't fell in love for the first time in his life. So that's funny. <laughs> oh, but that, like I said, that's my boy right there. Oh, uh, but yeah, this was a great episode. I loved it. Um, yeah, and I can't wait for the next episode. All right, guys. So that's my reaction. Um, I'm definitely going to see y'all later. Uh, like I said, I love you guys. Thank you so much for the support. All right. None of this would be happening without you guys. Okay. I really, really do appreciate it. If you're new to the channel, you know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, and click on the bell notification, and definitely comment. What did you like about this episode? And what did you like about, oh, I'm sorry. And did you like this video? Let me know in the comments below. Oh, and guys, like I said, remember. Oh, and like I said, guys, episode two of Blurred Lines, we're going to be recording it very, very soon, all right? I'll let you know what that release date going to be, okay? All right, guys, I'm out of here. Deuces. Love you. One love. Later.